Hello friends, what's up? My name is Rajan and welcome back to our YouTube channel. In the last video, we have learned how to convert SAS into CSS with the help of Ruby installer and CMD. In this video, we will learn again how to convert SAS into CSS with the application. So let's start. This is the SAS official website and today we are using application. So here are some applications for converting SAS into CSS. So I am using Prepose. It's a paid application for Mac, Windows and Linux. And you can also use as a trial version. And here is the website of Prepose. And you can download from any systems. So I have already downloaded it on my system. So I am just going to my desktop and opening my Prepose application. And here you can drag your project and if you want to add manually just click add button so I'm going to drag this project on repos and this is the project and these are the files in this project so I'm just click on style.scss and on the right side it's a property of scss where you want to convert this file into css if you want to change the path you can click here or when you edit the sas file this will auto compile automatically and uh, auto prefix minify css if you want to check these check boxes or to add some announcements like if you want to minify css just click on this okay so i'm going to edit sas file and we'll check this will working fine or not so i'm just going to open <coughs> index.html on in this project repos so I have written HTML syntax here and call the style.css link reference because browser don't understand the SAS file so that's why we reference the CSS file so I'm just going to edit SAS file so I have written here div which class box so I'm writing here one variable so when you defining variable so you just add the dollar sign and type which class you want which variable you define like primary color here and in the next line I am defining the class which is box and writing the code here like background color dollar primary color and I am also going to write width 500 pixel and height 500 pixel and I'm just going to save this file and this will automatically convert into CSS and bottom right side it successfully preloaded if you click on CSS it will automatically lift it if I talk about the auto prefix what is auto prefix in the SAS file I'm writing display flex so I have written only display flex and I am saving this file and it's again convert into CSS automatically so here in the CSS file auto prefix means they have automatically write the browser specific descriptions here so that's the way you can convert your CSS file into CSS and great thanks for watching video and if you like this video please subscribe and like and don't forget to share thank you so much thanks a lot